Let's return to the year of return and take you through excerpts of Afro Nation Day One, and then we'll continue with the conversation. Yeah, so Afro Nation there, let's quickly get on to the telephone lines. Uh, Rudy Kwachi is with the organizers. He's joining us. Uh, Rudy, how are you, sir? I know that uh, the Afro Nation is a four-day event also, and we should be uh, looking to day two, day three, day four. I want you to give me your fair assessment of how you think the first event went. Um, day one, well, it was, it was beautiful. Again, we used to and um, obviously, you know, having build a lot of challenges to get to that space. Apologies for my voice. But yeah, they won. They won with Australia. Mm. Rudy, we'd like to, uh, you to reposition yourself. Uh, we're not getting clear lines uh, through to you. But I know that there were... Uh, performances all sorts of performances on on the night and for you uh you 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 might have the the ability to tell us which performances you think top the day will that be shatawale um i can't pick one the funny part when you are the when you are the helm of these things you hardly actually see the things that unless you sit down and actually watch it to appreciate it from a fire position but I think all lines have been amazing um, from the, from start to finish in what their delivery has been. It's been world class. And it's neither our acts here or acts that we brought to. Everybody's been world class. Mm. And uh, so, so, what should uh, revelers and, uh, and uh, patrons expect for the next event? The next event, well, let's, let's get to today first. Today's our final day, and we invite people to uh, come and experience the vibe and, you know, uh, and that feel on the, on the beach that we, uh, we've been going on for the last few days. And after the last, after we bring it, you know, we wrap it up, and we'll start looking at uh, what the next event will be like. But today, we've got a final chance to see the band, maybe do and a host of other acts mm. performing tonight. Um, performing today, actually, at the beach. I know that prior to the event, uh, there was there were all those controversies over injunctions here and there, and which threatened to actually mar the event. Uh, so, uh, what has been the resolution of these? Uh, misunderstanding between ownership, SG, La, and the organizers of the Afro Nation concert. Where did you bring this? Uh, well, I mean, as it stands, as it stands right now, all I can say is, you know, a legal team has been pouring over all the all the things that came out of the woodwork. Uh, but, yes, and again, we're going to the last few days because, obviously, we know that we took all the boxes that we needed to, take to get things uh, done. And we, 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 we could never have done this in isolation. Um, great kudos to the team at the year of return and the Ghana Paris, especially with Takashi Akuma. With Nadia and the uh, head of the diaspora, you know, they've been, uh, they've been massive um, in their support. I mean, it's really to, to the mayor of Accra, uh, Mohamed J. So, a special mention uh, for Sailing Askeru and to the security forces. Uh, the mayor of Ladma, to Lekma. So there's a broad conversation that made this thing event happen. It wasn't something that's happening in isolation. Right. So we're glad that we came through all of that. Right, uh, Rudy, thank you very much. Uh, Rudy Kwachi.